Do you count us down? You're already in. Oh, really? Oh. Now you are. See, I had started a little while ago not knowing we weren't on yet. And so I you missed the good stuff. Yes, yeah. I'm never going to be that I don't, again. These, these formats don't give you any countdown. Well, like if you press the button, you're on. Well, well we're on. But we have to and know when I'm, you're doing that. What I was saying is... Because we could be doing something... No, we're not ever going to no, be doing well, that. That would be my hope. That would be my hope. <laughs> right. It's to Al, get you doing something strange. Tonight. So when he drinks rum, I'm so beautiful, right? <laughs> that he just the more rum he drinks, the more beautiful he thinks I am. It's true. So it's like a thing. Yeah. Have some rum. Yeah, have some more. <laughs> Yo ho ho. Yeah, yeah. So here we are, Bruce yeah. and Caroline's house. Uh, I love when we do uh, shows at Bruce and Caroline's house because then she cooks the dinner and she's an awesome cook and she's making spring rolls tonight. You're gonna to wanna to know how to make these. They are better than any of the spring rolls you get in restaurants. I'm, I'm oh, not that's kidding. Nice. And yeah. she knows how to better. use her V slicer like nobody I know. <laughs> she gets everything. How many V slicers have I had? Three. Right, but I just bought a new one. Four. Right, <laughs> I just bought a new one and I had instructions. And she's never used any of them. I've tried so many I times. Lose. We had three plastic ones and then we had the gonzo. For hundred and twenty dollars in stainless steel. Well, I lost it. So yeah, that one's not as good. And also, this is our friend Heather. Heather's Heather came for dinner tonight. She's she's in from out of town, and we were like, oh, okay. Well, our dinners are a little different. There's, yeah. She's yeah. like a lighting director, this is well, this and is well, you have to sing for your yeah. supper. <laughs> yeah. as, as my husband's favorite phrase is, nothing is free. Yeah, exactly. Right, and Bruce. You guys, and you guys know Never Bruce. Heard that before. <laughs> yeah. We like coming to Bruce and Caroline's house for dinner because it's free. Yeah. 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 No, and it's nothing great. is free. No, nothing wow. is it's free. always great. Nothing is free. We've never yeah. had a, a, a beam on the ceiling. You here. paid for this mail. That's Pardon? nice. Yeah, we paid for it. Hey, Al. How stupid are we? No, you didn't pay no. for it. Really? Stupid? No. Well, I'll build that for it. Yeah. <laughs> Money, no. So you guys want a little preview of what's happening? This is this, this is what's happening. At the summer's house. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you've seen me make this because I pretty much make it once a week. But it's this is what we're the making. Way the vegetables are sliced. It's like you can't hand cut uh, the the cucumbers like that. You just can't. Mm -hmm. You have to use the V slicer. Same thing with the carrots. You have to use the V slicer. So I had the Caroline. carrots. I actually yeah. did cut by hand because I actually sliced my hand recently. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. I was the v slicer. Because remember when I left the safety handle at your house? Yeah. Oh. I was yeah. using it without the safety handle, oh. and Bruce was looking at me, oh. and he he had that look on his face like, "Don't do that." And I was like, I, "I'm a professional. I do this. I know what." And gosh darn it, if I just didn't slice that finger. No, thank God it wasn't worse. So what does that mean? Wow. Slice your finger. I I I had a gash in my finger. It means we're it was not be good. eating her finger tonight. No, no, it wasn't tonight. It was oh, another night. So tonight, tonight that's why I hand cut it. You already ate it. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. Did you actually, when that happened, did you actually say, "Gosh darn it"? She's like, "Oh yeah, twice." No, I said something, something way more vulgar. You know me. I cuss like a sailor. Yeah. I cuss like a sailor. It's bad. Yeah. It's fun though, isn't it? Yeah. It's fun though. Cussing like a sailor? Yes. yes. Only with people you know really well. No. Once I swore on, I, I swore on Facebook and I got But you didn't really swear. No, you just. No, I was, imit I was, was imitating you swearing. No, but you weren't really swearing. No. It was a. Uh, it was a, she said GD. Yeah. yeah. So it was, the, it was yeah. using the Lord's and name in vain. Came up, a sign came up. They don't care if you say fuck, just don't. Damn oh, our God. Yes. That's... And then we were out to dinner the other right? night. I'm, right. I'm kind of right. Yeah. You guys we know what I'm talking about. The other night with some friends. And as we were getting <laughs> yeah, the car to leave, yeah. she says to me, that, that means him. That's one smart son of a bitch. So I get in the car and go, you know what? You're a smart son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. I'm so proud. Yeah. I'm so, it's wonderful to be here. What? Smart son of a bitch. Smart son of a bitch. Yeah. 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 Okay. That's one of the things I like about you. I like your yeah. smarts. Thank you. I like that you think ahead. And you like something else about me that rhymes with smart. Yeah. 
<laughs> but we won't discuss that. No, because it's you. She you doesn't like it when you fart. I actually envy it. <laughs> They're, they're, what else they're, rhymes with they were, smart? Their news were, yeah. Heart? That's what it is. Heart. His beautiful heart? They're, they're, um, what they else? Be in Ripley's. We've been together too long. Yeah. We could put his what in else? Ripley's. Roger and I are looking at each other. Bruce, what rhymes with smart? No, fart. you're right. Yeah, oh, it is fart. Oh, it's fart. Oh. Yeah, yeah. He's and got, you have him you convinced that you like his <laughs> farts. <laughs> well, they're not offensive. No. They're just noisy. They're not oh, offensive. okay. There's no uh, offensive part. Well, because he's so clean. Offensive. Yeah. Well, and really if you're annoying. musical, <laughs> if you're musical, they're in G sharp. <laughs> <laughs> See, you never know what the show's going to be about. We well, weren't planning we're on here. talking yeah. about Heather. <laughs> yeah. Well, our family. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yes, <laughs> Valerie. We meant heart. I don't even heart. Know if smart there. rhymes with. We have um, eight hundred people on you're Facebook. Out. Oh. Yeah. And a hundred people I on Instagram. We should do a survey. We should find out how many people, well, it's usually guys, okay? Where are you going with this? What? Where are you going with I'm this? I'm not going anywhere. I want to take a survey. Yeah. And find out how many, is it mostly women out there? We're, we have a high, we have a, we have a lot of men too, but okay. a high percentage of women, yeah. We should find out how many spouses do that openly and happily with their spouse on a regular uh, basis. Do you do you blow wind in front of your spouse? That's let's what we see, want to know. Because you. we know a couple have been married for over 50 years. They don't do it in front of each other mm -hmm. and they don't go to the bathroom in front of each other. And I'm thinking, I don't know how you do that, okay? They do it, yeah. Uh -huh. So get, give us your comments because, right. well, who knew the show would go here, yeah. but. Um, right into right into it. <laughs> you know, the human condition is really important, mm -hmm. okay? That's yeah. what our relationship is, is the human condition. Right? Well, what do you mean? What aspect of the human condition? Just All aspects. Yeah, All like the... conditioning humans. How <laughs> <laughs> well, come you have, shade, you have shade on your face? Because of you. Really? Yeah, is that you? No, it's, com it's the it's, sun. It's the sun coming through the kitchen. Oh. Sun coming oh, through the, the window. Sun. Yeah. Oh, Here right, comes the, the sun. Dr. Oz says to do it. He says to blow in front of your response. Karna yes. Hansen, I'm looking at two cameras and cooking a dinner, so I do try to look at the responses. See, I saw, I saw yours. Yeah, yeah. Hi, Karna. Yeah. Um, Is Dr. Oz on? And No. Devin O'Kelly says, yes, if you can fart in front of your, if you can't fart in front of your spouse, who can you fart in front yeah. of? Yeah. Lydia is a no. That's, That's a, a straight no. Yeah. No, no Lydia. Yeah. So what do you do, Olivia? Is it Lydia? Lydia. Oh, Lydia? Lydia. Lydia. What do you do, yeah. Lydia? You save them up and then you sneak off somewhere oh. in another part of the house and let her rip? What, what, how does it work? And El Elizatano says, my husband definitely does and loves it. He's like Al, musical but not offensive. <laughs> yeah, not offensive. So when they're musical, I just get kind of envious because that's got to feel great. Really okay. great. I have yep. to do something for a friend. Uh -huh. Somebody really wants to know where your blouse is from, okay? I it's made the silky. blouse. I made this blouse, by the way. She, we don't sell this blouse. Yeah. We're not getting any Al's promotion off again. of it. By the way, this is Al lying. He mm. lies sometimes. Yeah. I made so it. He, he lies to you from time to time. Yeah. Okay. yeah. The blouse is by okay. Selkie, S-E-L-K-I-E. Oh, you can get it online. They love your blouse, and they love your shoes. Well, I was hoping you all would notice. Wow, look at that. I know. Wow. I know. They love the shoes. And it has, it has Can we toe, see the side? Oh, decolleté. What is it? Decolletage. Decolleté. Well, yes. Yeah. yeah, that's toe cleavage. Toe Mainly because I've got such long toes yeah. that no toes fit in my shoes. Yeah, you could hang from Can't, a chandelier. Yeah. With I have long hand. toes. Yeah. Candace says um, her husband does it all. And then he says, here's a little kiss for you. <laughs> <laughs> Becky excuses herself and goes to another room. That's so nice, Becky. Becky, how long have you been married? <laughs> it's just a new relationship. <laughs> Judy says, my husband does and laughs so hard about it that he almost passes out. <laughs> you know, it is And funny. he would pass out if yeah. he didn't. So. Yeah. Susan says, it's the more you toot, the better you feel. Oh, well, that's a beans for every meal. Right. Yeah, what is that? Beans, beans, the musical fruit. The, the more, more you, you eat, eat the, the more, more you, you toot. toot. So, so, the 
the more you took, the better you feel. Yeah, so, so that's that amazing. Would be for every, every meal. meal. Yeah. Right. Teresa says she does not do that unless it happens accidentally. Oh, that's mom. <laughs> <laughs> Sherry says, my husband and I have a bit of wind in front of each other. It's human nature. Absolutely. And Marilyn says, my husband wakes up and puts around the house. When my mother was getting older, we'd be sitting together, and all of a sudden you'd hear, I go, Mom, I know, I can't help you. Aww. <laughs> Linda locks her son in the car, and then she does it. <laughs> Wow, we're going to sell so many of your blouses tonight. They all just want to know about yeah, your blouse. Why are we making this blouse? Yeah. You know, it's cute, isn't it? Pink and white polka dots. Jelena says, my husband does it, locks the car windows. <laughs> That's You know, uh, when I used to uh, headline at the Riviera, remember when Roseanne was the opening act? Yes. And so I uh, would stand in the wings uh, at the end of her act waiting to go on, so I wouldn't be late, of course. And her last joke, it was when Ronald Reagan was president, and right. she go, this, I'm doing Roseanne, forgive me if I don't do it well. You know who makes a cute couple? <laughs> Nancy and Ronnie. Every night when they go to bed, he holds her head under the covers <laughs> and farts. Oh, God. <laughs> There was something else to it, but I, I would sit in the wings every night, and I, don't, I once had my humor analyzed. There's um, philosophical, social, and toilet. Gee, I Get, wonder which one is yours. <laughs> I guess what I laughed most at, I mostly laughed at That's toilet humor, because farting jokes are funny. Yeah. Well, farting Doris DiGiulielmo says, we don't excuse ourselves, we blow it loud and hard. <laughs> yeah. It's very healthy to release. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Pam said, we blame the dog. Yeah, yeah, that's Chee -chee. Like, yeah, that's where like, are you, Chi? Song. When you wake up in the morning and the bed is kind of wet, blame the baby, blame the baby. Is that it? That's it. It's about bedwetters. Oh. Um, Suzanne, oh. would you like Did to you know make spring roll dressing with me? Pardon? Yeah, you can tell. tell oh, go ahead. Well, spring roll dressing. Yeah, that was a bedwetter. Bedwetting right? stories first, then dressing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. which was a little girl. And uh, she was living in this, uh, uh, let me say, dysfunctional home, <laughs> mm -hmm. okay? And so she was a bedwetter, and so they got this screen. The nitrite the, company. They put this screen underneath her sheet, and if one drop of moisture hit the screen, a, a siren would go off, and the light would start flashing, and she had to get out of bed and go to the bathroom and then come back, right? Come back, change the, when nothing would go off and she'd run, go to the bathroom, uh, dry off the screen and- Yeah, they're trying to do behavioral modifications yeah, so and so wake up before. Yeah, so once everything was dry, then the, the, the light would go off and the bell would go off. So I shared a room with my older sister, Maureen. So she'd come home from dates and, um, or sometimes with girlfriends and go, watch. <laughs> <laughs> and she'd come over to my bed and spit on the screen. I go, oh, and I run to the bathroom and close the thing. She said, laugh. But you know what? I stopped wetting the bed. Yeah. You figured it out. Um, before, <laughs> before, <laughs> before, before we move on, Steel Lit 13 said, my grandma had machine gun farts. <laughs> oh, I love to hear those. There should be a recording of everybody's different kinds of farts. They're all different and they're all Is different. Is there an app for that? <laughs> Yeah, a fart app. That's a good idea. Fart it's, app. Right. Yeah. Now it's gone. The idea yeah. is now out in the ether. So you yeah. There's got to be a whoopee. Yeah, no, exists. there is. There yeah. Exists. Bruce yeah. has is it. Is a fart app? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He used to entertain the kids with it all the time. This is our base oh, yeah. humanity, right? Yeah. Actually, we yeah, were in, like, this, years ago, Suzanne and I were in this five-star restaurant in New York, one of those fancy, expensive places where you can get the same food down the street, but... The right. Not, on the, nice, not yeah. on the nice plates. Right. So we're in this, and people actually are not talking loudly. They're talking to one another. They're sort of whispering back and forth. Right? Mm -hmm. So I had a farting thing on my iPhone. <laughs> Ow, okay. no. So while everyone was talking, I pushed the button, and it went. <laughs> oh my 
and I didn't let on it was me, okay? About a minute later, I heard from across the room, <laughs> and then there was a guy over here, okay? He got into it too, and pretty soon, there were three of us. Remember that guy on your Leslie Nielsen? Remember oh, Leslie yeah. Nielsen? And from airport, air, uh, airplane. 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 Yeah. Airplane. So he was on. I was doing the talk show in Canada, and, and Leslie Nielsen was on, and I was interviewing him. And all of a sudden, in the middle of the interview, I heard, <laughs> and everyone looked around, including me. Okay. Because it's like on the dais, you know, yeah. like a mm -hmm. Johnny Carson kind so of. So we point continued, out. and then I, a minute later, I hear, <laughs> again. And I thought, this guy's in trouble. <laughs> he, should be, he, should be, he shouldn't be sitting on the couch. Okay? But it turned out he had a device in his hand, okay? And he would activate it with his thumb. That was his thing. Oh. He had a farting machine. Oh, awesome. Uh, that, you know what? that would be a perfect gift. We should be selling yeah. farting machines. Yeah. I'll work so on that's that. That's the perfect gift. Monday. <laughs> Um, yeah. I'll work on that Monday. By the yeah. way, you guys, we have a 30% off sale at SuzanneSummers.com anything. tonight. Anything, anything you want. We're just hey, cooking I and hanging out tonight. Some questions. I, I, I thought the response to the Dr. Mike show about the gut was just yeah. so incredible, yeah. so informative. He was so, um, his explanations were so great, weren't they? Did any of you react to that show? I, I think it's, uh, I'd like to do more doctor interview shows like that. They were so it was good. great. Really, really great. great. Really great. Yeah. It was a great show. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Great show. Yeah, we always love having so Dr. Often Mike. We sit around and talk about farting, but you got to get serious every so often <laughs> and have a Dr. Mike on the show that yeah. really tells you. you know. And also, all that stuff we talked about in the gut health show um, would help if you're having gas or bloating. <laughs> That's what the whole show was about. Yeah. So well, we joke, way, but. Yeah. 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 Your probiotic, um, prebiotic, liver renew. Gentle colon cleanse. Don't forget about gentle colon cleanse. Did you say dental or gentle? And the digestive gentle. enzymes, yeah. Gentle, it's like having, you can, you can have it. it cold, but at night make it with, it. keep a hot pot in your, in your bathroom, or I mean in your bedroom, and then just drink a little cup go. of tea at night. Ah, just hold it up well, next to your face. Well, look, there you like go. Like the good old days. That's right, the job I got fired from. Exactly. I was hired to do yeah. this. Gentle colon cleanse. Gentle colon renew. Renew. Yes, yeah. we couldn't yeah, use the word cleanse. cleanse, yeah. And it's not a cleanse, it's a gentle yeah. release. Oops. And it's you like know. a nice cup of tea before you go to bed, yeah. or you could have it cold. You know I that, see you use it. You know that Suzanne is um, Yes, there is a code. Sorry, Alan, excuse me one sec. The code is FAM30, F-A-M-30. What is it? Yeah. FAM30, F-A-M-30. Yeah. So I have to tell you that the first time Suzanne and I met, was on the set of a game show I was doing for ABC called yeah, The Anniversary like, Games. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And she was hired as the prize model. She had never been in a TV studio. This was 10 years before Three's Company. And uh, no one said, by the way, look into the camera with the red light. So when the announcer said, the, the guy who said, hey, you won the 20 cubic foot refrigerator freezer by Gelson, blah, blah, blah. She opened the door and yeah. started looking around the studio yeah, and they fired her the first day <laughs> and it was one of those terrible things that happened the but the good thing is that, that huh? you got her number huh? you got my number well, it took a yes. while to get her number because the guy who booked her teased me and said i don't know if i should give you that contact information <laughs> Okay. I said, well, think about this. Yeah. If you don't, I'll have you fired. <laughs> <laughs> uh, good thing yeah. it was the 1960s. Yeah. Is that legal? Uh, Not anymore. Uh, yeah, but then it was. Yeah, intimidation. Yeah. Then no, she intimidation was really happy works. about it. Yeah. yeah. He uh, blew up a picture of me. Uh, oh, where do you see this picture? Uh, that, uh, you know, we women are so hard on ourselves and. I never knew what I looked like, and I, he blew up this picture that he found. It was right around the time that we met. Mm -hmm. so, Where do you see this picture? I was looking at it last night, and I went, wow, you know how today uh, the girls are very professional in their selfies and everything? This was someone taking a picture of me, and you knew I didn't feel worthy of having my picture. Was it that one's in the purple shirt? The one's in that purple? No. 
Oh, you Those are so yeah. innocent. Yeah, next time you oh, wow. come from our house, really okay. see this picture. Yeah, awesome. I mean, it's an amazing picture. And if you, if you put the camera on it and just look at it, you un totally understand who she was when she was 20 years old. Silvana, we will show you that picture when next time we're at Suzanne's yeah. house. We're at yeah. my house tonight. Yeah. Okay, so That's we have to make some dressing. Yeah, look at the picture. Is I remember seeing that picture, thinking it's not a good picture. Wow! You know, you never. Of course. We, we women, we never see ourselves or what we are. The nice thing, uh, for all of you who are younger than me, the nice thing I'm finding now. Everybody's is younger than you. Seventy-two. Yeah. Well, I like it. You're seventy-two. Yeah. I don't think I've ever slept with a seventy-two-year-old woman. Well, before. now you have. <laughs> but the nice thing is, the great thing that happens, and it's really true. I know who I am. And they say the two big questions in life are who am I and what do I want? And it's so incredible to know who you are. It's taken me my whole life. So don't feel like if you can't answer the question yet. It's a lot of introspective uh, searching and taking responsibility for every choice you've ever made in your life. Hello. There are good ones and bad ones. Who's what this? Oh. Oh. Look who's here. Look who's here. Oh, a Chi Chi and a Violet. Hi, Violet. This is my, our granddaughter, and she doesn't know who she loves the most, me or him. No, no, I know who she loves the most. <laughs> <laughs> she told me. She told me when she was 12. Oh. <laughs> no, I never get it. It's she all said, right. You know why I love you so much? Because we're both quirky. Said, That's true. You two are quirky. <laughs> She brings her purse to the kitchen. She are you said, reading? This is a great lady here. This is very special. To wear? <laughs> oh. Whoa. Whoa. So there we go. Uh oh. Sorry. No worries. What happened? Uh, Grammy's lost. tequila. No, you're is that God talking? No worries. <laughs> Hey, Violet, will you make your peanut sauce for the... Uh, oh, Violet, make your peanut sauce. We have two sauces tonight. Do we have peanut butter? So Bruce has two beautiful well, women we, around I him I did have a brand new jar of peanut butter. Did you take it with you? And his friend, um, Heather. I've seen And then the beautiful Heather daughter is my cosmic sister. sister. That's right. Oh, this yeah. is Heather. Yeah. <laughs> we both decided that you know, I in another life that you... we were brother and sister. Well, I see him with the smiles on both of them. Aren't they I, have, I mean, she bought it. I just... This lifetime, we happen to look similar. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna, go make, these we're gonna make dressing. Yeah. So we're gonna make the sauce now. You know, now. everything okay. tonight is thirty percent off. All, all the things that you got. Um, I gave a, a box of product to this uh, man that um, we interact with every day. He's on our street, and Hello? last night when we we're uh, driving out of our house, he stopped me and he said. Do you know, I used to be, he's a young guy, 300 pounds, and he said, and I lost the weight. He said, I'm now down to 120 or something. And he said, I care so much about what I put into my body. And when you sent me that box of all your organic products, he said, you have no idea what it put into me. And I thought, man, does he get it? And he probably will never put that weight on again. Because he's taking every choice. See, it's all about choices. And the choices we make, good or bad, affect our outcome. And he's made a choice to, I don't want to be that person I used to be. Isn't that I don't great? I want to be sluggish. I don't want, I don't want to carry that weight around. He's a young guy. He's probably not married. And he probably, you know, is hoping to be. And he will. It's amazing. He's got this cute face, doesn't yeah. he? He's so cute. He's adorable. He's a nice he wanted, guy. He said that he lost all that weight, but he needed, what do they call that? He has a, a stretch marks yeah, from stretch using marks. the weight. So we're going to look into seeing if we could. I don't know if we can. That's a, and like you said, maybe coconut oil. Maybe, or something. You know, maybe, maybe there's, there's a, something our formula could come up that. with for stretch marks. I know it would work, but it's a chemical. Okay. No, we're not going to do chemical. That. No, yeah. mm -hmm. no. Why? Stretch well, they're becoming in style too. What? They're becoming stylish. Stretch marks? Yeah. Well, there you go. Well, they're becoming. They, we're we're trying to. Let they're women know they don't have to be friends. they don't have to be perfect to be beautiful. That's oh. that's I'm, what she I'm means by a different kind of grandma. <laughs> and I'm into trying to achieve perfection at all times. Which <laughs> keeps it has kept me in therapy now for seventeen years. <laughs> <laughs> this is how I've chosen to live my life. 
<laughs> so for those of you asking, yes, it is everything on SuzanneSummers.com is 30% off. Oh, and the here? promo code is FAM30, F-A-M-30. Yeah, okay, we're going to move over here yeah, now. So, let's, Al, let's will you put it, will you sit in Suzanne's seat and Suzanne, right will you sit where Suzanne is so I can put the camera here? Okay. Okay. She's so gorgeous, you almost don't want to. So I have to sit where you're sitting. Yeah, Suzanne, you're going to come around and, all right. All right, and then you, Roger, you can get a little closer. Yeah. Do you all know that Roger's back here? Say yeah. hi, Roger. Yes. Oh, I'm going to make this one. There's Roger. You're going to Roger, make who's you can been with me for 40 yeah. years. And by the almost way, you know, Carol, Caroline is holding Chi-Chi the dog, um, but Chi-Chi well, doesn't know. Chi-Chi doesn't know. Chi Chi's going to be part of our spring rolls. <laughs> oh, that's cool. That's Uh, so okay, let's get the food us. going here. I'm hungry. Right. You okay. want to be on this side? You want to be on this side, don't you? Sure. This side. Okay. So you, you guys have seen me make this, and everyone asks me for the recipe, and I don't usually measure, but I'm going to figure it out. It's really about having the right ingredients. This is a toasted sesame oil. I order this by toasted the case. Toasted is better than just regular sesame oil. Good. Got it? Okay. It, uh, the toasted sesame oil, it tastes like 100% better, doesn't oh, it? Oh, yeah. Yeah. This is the rice vinegar that I use. I like the seasoned one. It's the organic rice vinegar. And that's the, that's the base of the dressing. This is fried ginger that I make. I cut up and peel the ginger and then I cook it on in the little sesame oil until it gets all toasty. Now you can just that's use powdered work. ginger. Do it's you peel it? I peel it that's and I chop this? it. I had three times this much and I burned it. Oh, and I started awful. over. I was talking to Heather and this I started. This is an hour, right? Do you burn yeah, it so again? This because you did that last week. Well, I'm because sorry. it's so boring to yeah. to to slice ginger. So yeah. Oh no, it's tea. No, I felt bad. So anyway, it. okay. Here's here's what you do. This is super simple. It's equal amounts. Oh, will you get the tamari for me? Uh, sure. Equal Chase, amounts. What happened to Heather? She just went to the bathroom. Okay, so September 8th. this just has little hashtags on it, so I'm going to do... So never do today what you can push to tomorrow. <laughs> Heather went to the bathroom. Okay. okay. All right, so one part... <laughs> Don't alert the media. <laughs> one part sesame oil. I think we have bad you just met her. You just met her. <laughs> she can't be the butt of a fart joke. We got bad Al tonight. Uh, the butt of a fart. Hey, hey. But I'm bomb. Hey, hey. This wow. is That's a, a t-shirt. Tamari is just a gluten-free <laughs> soy sauce, and this is an organic one. I'm not. We don't sell any of these products. It's just what I use. This is just like a, a little splash. splash. Organic is uh, crucial for soy sauce because otherwise you're going to get GMO sprayed with poison yeah. and soybeans. Enough. So I would Please say this is like as best you can. a half of a line. So I did one part vinegar, one part oil, a half a part of tamari. You were a butt of a fart joke. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome to the bathroom. Excuse myself. She went to the bathroom. Yeah. Yeah. Next time you're going to have to leave it here. Yeah. You, know what I mean? <laughs> you can use powdered dry ginger if you want, but I have fresh. Have so I'm going to use the fresh. It's awful to do the fresh, but it's worth it. But it's just, a, this is actually great. Like, yeah. when I do this, I sometimes just yeah. do it separately. Not as good. Not as good. It's not as good, but it's still really good. Okay, but I'm saying not as good. <laughs> You've had it with this. Okay. And you've still swooned. <laughs> I, I is that swoon. another fart joke? Not as good? <laughs> this is I swoon dry mustard. Food. Yes. Yeah, by the way, Heather. And are, are we a just teaspoon decided you are going to be famous for your, uh, your bathroom habits. I'm going to be famous for my bathroom habits. Yes, no. All in it. Yes. Okay. <laughs> just to be daddy. Yeah. Yeah. Can you see? Yep. This is the good news That's about is better being conducted in our family. Yeah. <laughs> Meet daddy. Okay, so you just stir that. That's like the basic, and then I switch this up sometimes. I would never with her, but sometimes I will add some Thai fish sauce. 
but I don't do that. No, I, well, you instead can. of the I can't taste it in there. Okay, well, so no, I mean, I'm can, changing. I'm ordering fish at restaurants and things. Oh, mm, yeah, a little Thai fish sauce oh, is good. Fish. This also, this sweet chili sauce, if you, I mean, this is a, a major sugar thing. Yeah, but that's, so, the, that's like pulls us together. Yeah, I mean, this is great. And I don't usually put it in this, but sometimes I do this as a separate sauce if I want like more of a sweet. It is really good. You want some in there tonight? Yeah. For sure. I'll have one open. Just, For sure. No, just tiny bit. Oh yeah, because you don't want sugar. Yeah. Okay, I'll, I'm not gonna do it. We can do it on the side. Do you we want me can, to make my peanut Why don't you now? like do a little, a yes. little thing for Violet and then a, a good thing for all of us. Yeah, that's true. How but I'm going to make a peanut sauce and I really think you're going to like it. All right. Okay, and then also, I always put my sriracha on the side because, and I let people add their own yeah. because yeah. everyone likes different yeah. amounts. But yeah. that's the basic. You guys have asked me, everyone has asked me for this recipe, so there it is. There and you then go. We're going to show you how we put it on the spring rolls. But Violet also makes an incredible peanut sauce, so. Okay. Take it away, Violet. We thought we, we in the middle. Sure. We thought we had a big jar of peanuts, but all we have is this little we thing. Do. I just have to text Aaron, so, but my phone is. Right now, we're just going to make a single serving peanut sauce, or like maybe for two people. And it's really liquid peanuts, isn't it? This is peanut butter. Oh. So it's. Called liquid peanuts. Whoa. It's peanut butter. <laughs> it's about one ounce. Uh huh. One ounce of peanut butter. Who thought of putting peanut butters in, in little packages? Hey, who thought oh, of putting They do it a lot. Is now. it normally a jar and you put a spoon in the jar and go put some peanut butter? This is like if you want just a little bit of just having a workout or something. Some people do so that. So you squirt peanut butter in your mouth? It's like in to go. Out. Like if you yeah. wanted to bring it yeah. with you to have with your apples. You want to go? <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Yeah, I guess. Do you know I went out to a restaurant in Malibu the other Sesame night? Sesame oil. Which is frequented uh -huh. by millennials. Uh -huh. We're like the old people there, but they like us. You know. And, uh, no. Oh. And uh, one one of the offerings was lettuce, a cucumber, and a carrot. That's so wow. weird. I oh was my god. Huh. Yeah, by the way, by the way speaking here, of why. millennials, there will okay. not be any of them. I'm not measuring that to much. I'm sorry, Stones guys. The Rolling Stones concert really we're going to. So I just put we're in a splash. We'll be the here. youngest people She's teaching. at the concert. I put a splash of the toasted sesame oil. Now I'm putting a splash of this rice vinegar. It's this about very nice. Just equal parts. It's not quite equal parts. You put more of the peanut butter and less of the other stuff. But I always just like use a recipe online and then I make it up myself and like change everything about it. I'm so sorry. No, I just want to clean it up before it gets on the. And then I put a little bit of ginger. <laughs> this is dry ginger, sorry. And then I put a little bit of sriracha. Do you cook like this in Italy when you go back? All the time. Yeah, like, she's such a good cook. She and then I put, time. actually, the fish Well, you know what's great better. about uh, Violet? She's been cooking at her mother's knees since she sauce. was this infant. And that's how we all learn at her mother's knee. Yeah. And that is what been. Uh, what? what? She said our fathers. Some people have dads who cook. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Yeah, that's true. Much okay, and then what sauce. do we use this peanut sauce for? For the spring rolls. Okay, so we dip in your mom's sauce and we dip in this? Yeah, it's like, and then, yeah, and then we could also do a sweet sauce way. if you want to do this a sweet sauce. This pretty sweet though. Oh, okay. that's true, it is. Do you put chili, okay. do you put, you don't put the chili sauce in there. I actually do put a little bit of the oh, chili okay. sauce. Oh, okay, well then, now we and have then, it. Yeah, and I it thought you didn't want that because of the sugar. Well, I don't think I'm eating this sauce. So. Oh. But then no. we have a sweet one and a savory one. You yeah. eat no sugar? No. No, I eat a little bit sometimes, or like fruit she sugar. Does, yeah. some, she barely eats But no, sometimes in Italy, I see you posting pictures with ice cream, gelato. Mm, it might not be mine. Oh, wait, the garlic. I need to put garlic in Here's there. Here's your garlic. garlic. Here. Can you? Where's the garlic press? Here you go. Sorry, this recipe's not that organized, but it's not that hard to mess up. So if you just try it with all the ingredients and get it to the consistency you like, it'll be fine. Um, your grandfather wants to tell his story. What story? About the Rolling Stones. Oh, no, I was just going to say we're going to the Rolling Stones concert. We are going to the Rolling Stones concert. At that Rose Bowl? Uh -huh. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Wow. Oh, big time. I wouldn't we got I would tickets. believe I'd see you there. The last time I saw there. the Rolling Stones was 45 years ago. I took wow. Steve. You know, he's here, and a friend of ours offered us two tickets, and we went, 
you know, you may never see him again. No, it'll be fun. I've seen them probably ten times. They're really? Great. Yeah. Really? And he, he's not just the most fit guy at 70, he's the most fit guy I've ever yeah, seen. Yeah, he is. You know what he does? Wow. Yeah. He's, he's yoga. Yoga. Yoga, <laughs> yoga, yoga. I'm telling you, yoga, if you've ever even considered it, that's how you get in the greatest shape ever. It's all about breathing. What? And he practices singing while running. Oh, wow. Wow. That's good training in the lungs. Yeah. You want to be careful when you eat peanuts. Absolutely. Not too okay, much. Okay, so what did you just bring out there, dear? Oh, your violet. This looks good. Wait, okay, do you, you want to try it? Yeah. See if it's good. I can tell it's good. Can you see Show that? Yep. the spoon. And we have a yeah. fast pass. Okay, that looks great. So you know this is going to be the sweet sauce. We and then the other one's going to be the same. Try it. Tell them yeah, right. Well, we're going <laughs> to sit down and eat it. Right? They want to see And a whole bunch of events they, before they the concert them. starts. Okay. Yeah. That's, so, that's so well. Mm. We won't be Very participating good. in that. I think there's a little oil. More? Very good. I already put Have patience getting there. It's yeah. a tough venue it's to get tough. in and out of. Really? No. Yeah. yeah. Wow, just that's a little bit Yeah. Yeah, 100,000 seats. It was just a little hot in the vinegar. Yeah. And it's in a little valley. Yay. Like the only thing in the okay. little valley is oh, it's a little get salt. There. And also you put a little water in it too. Oh yeah? Oh yeah. Oh, from my house. From yeah, your me. house, leave Thank three you. hours. Yeah. Wow. Wow. It's in Pasadena. Yeah. 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 It's like very yes. flavorful. How long is it going to take to get home? Okay, thank you. Uh, but from can, I'm always can we had a van with that in there in Malibu. <laughs> 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 she put a van on the way home. Oh, okay. Yeah, so getting home probably an hour and a half. Just that's about yeah. how long it takes. Mm -hmm. You want to? So you know what's great about these edamame is that they are organic. That's so important because most soy, more soy, ninety-three percent of all soy and corn in the world is now genetically modified, 93%. Mm -hmm. I live in a world of stats and I find it shocking. So when you find um, edamame, which are the, you know, the soybeans, and when you find corn that's organic, get it. And Hashtag what up, Monsanto? <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> it's we, common that know, people we, think you- know, we you. started sprouting. What's sprouting? Broccoli sprouts. Mm. Did you say common? No. <laughs> it's common that people. Wait, what? No, did you see common on the rapper? Did you say common? The rapper common on the Tonight Show the other night? Jimmy he was Fallon? rapping about Chrissy Snow. Oh, really? Yeah. So he had a crush on her. Oh my god. Isn't that cool? Well, what I told you? Awesome. I'm a different kind, kind of, of grandmother. grandmother. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay, so I brought out some party favors for Heather because she's not aware of any of your products. Oh, no. I want to go sit next to Alan, then we're going to eat spring rolls. Okay. All right. But you can show Heather your products because I just figured we might as well okay, talk so do about... Okay, I sit where Al's sitting or where do I sit? You should probably stand right here, right? Me? Yes. Yeah. You All right, right perfect. Here. Roger, do your thing. On camera yeah. direct, stand there. Okay. Okay. Now, Heather's in shock, by the way, just so, <laughs> so you know, okay? Heather's from South Jersey. South Jersey, South that's right. South Jersey, and here she is in L.A., and I, I told you With a typical that. L.A. family. Someone she's said gonna, you looked like Cindy Crawford. Yeah, she's going to be. Wow, yeah. I love you. Thank you. Wow, <laughs> <laughs> you just made my day. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> if you want to continue looking like Cindy Crawford, Cindy Crawford, you might want to use our everyday cleanser. <laughs> <laughs> right, girls? Absolutely. They all know out there, this is two in one. You can take off your eye makeup if you wear any, put it all over your face, and mm -hmm. it won't sting your eyes, it won't make your eyes puff up or anything because there's not a single chemical in this. I use it every night. Every night. Yeah. Look at her skin. Me too, day we and all, night. We all use it. It's um, got this little insignia, certified toxic free, means it's grown organically, extracted mm -hmm. organically, and nothing upwind or downwind of the product can be toxic to contaminate it. Upwind pure, or downwind? Are we back to Are we <laughs> 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 to say, wow, we've gone full circle today. <laughs> <laughs> and then there used to be this cream that I bought when I was doing Three's Company. It was 150 bucks a jar. And when we went into this business, I brought that jar to her, and I said, can you get close okay. to this? She said, I can do so much better. She said, there's like this much sea algae in it, and that's what they... Uh, push. Mm -hmm. This is um, mostly all sea algae from purified water and uh, African birch, which was used in 
Africa for centuries as medicine. Mm -hmm. Now, why do you care about sea algae? Because sea algae is the buzzword in wrinkles, and you don't have any yet, and if you don't want to have any, this is an incredible peptide. It targets the skin. This is Again, it's got the little insignia on it. Perfect. Certified toxic free. Then, you gotta have a moisturizer, right? Yep. You've heard Best of moisturizer. You've heard of CoQ10? Mm hmm Okay. So, you know, you have a, we're, we're a bunch of cells. We're 40 trillion cells. That's what you are. You're taller, so maybe you're 45 trillion cells. <laughs> um, but that's what a human being is, is cells. And every cell has to talk to one another all the time. It's mm -hmm. a communication system. It's like they're all talking. Uh, in the center of each of our cells is the mitochondria, which is the energy mm -hmm. center of the cell. Mm -hmm. But if it doesn't have CoQ10, it's like a motorboat with, a, with an outboard motor without the ripcord. The CoQ10 is the ripcord for the energy. Now you're thinking, well, we're talking about a moisturizer for skin. You. These are all cells, right? right. And what's the difference between really young skin and, and older skin? No energy. CoQ10 puts back the energy. Oh, look at that. Okay. So it's got other things in there, but it's like it's just like this beautiful moisturizer. And it's like, just like take a piece of that. Yeah. So while, while you're telling that, I have to answer Doris has been persistent. Doris. Sorry, Doris, I hadn't been able to answer your question. Awesome. Your targeted night cream, it is, the, well, I guess it's the last thing you put on at night. I usually put my eye nice. cream on after my oh, night cream. It's like, but it's the that. last step you after that, the serums. You do that. Okay. This at night, I um, almost died uh, climbing the Alps. Was it the Alps or the Alps? Yeah. The Alps. Remember when we, we climbed the Alps and we almost died? Where were this you is climbing me, the This Alps? is me lying. And um, <laughs> I saw a tree sticking out of the top of the highest Alp. And I went, wow, it's an alpine, alpine rose. And, and it was encrusted in ice because it's cold up there. Yet these beautiful pink roses were growing out of the ice. And we, in our company, went, got to have pretty strong stem cells. Mm. So this has alpine rose stem cells mm. in it, and we are legally allowed to say it doesn't... Helps reduce the appearance of fat me. bags and, and dark circles. I want to say gets rid of fat bags and dark circles, but I got to do the health reduce thing. Health reduce the appearance, the appearance of, of fat bags and... I need that. <laughs> yeah. Right. So you see people who have like these fat bags and the dark circles. This is your friend, but also um, if you're a Summers, like look at him. He's he's young, but he's got wrinkles because he smiles all the time. Who like, so, Smiler. Yes. No, smile wise. You know, it happens. I've got them too. We smile all the time. So you put this on. Remember Carson on that show? So you put it on and you pat, pat, pat in the little line places here. And then you put it on your lid. I'm not going to do that because I have eye makeup on right now. You put it on your lid. Now, most eye creams, they tell you, don't put it on your lid. And the reason they tell you that is because it has chemicals in it. And that will make oh. your eyes puff up and be irritated and stingy. Not this. Not this. And finally, but this is not finally in our line. We have so many more lines. Oh. This. Do we all love, will it, you love this? Uh, yeah, I've used that. I've you don't use this. As I don't use it as much because I, I I'm not a, I'm not big on oily skin. Oh, so skin I use is so oily but, too. Yeah. But but but. But the backs you of your arms on? didn't yeah. it get rid of the bumps on you the backs the bumps of your on arms? Your arms? Yeah. It also. Um, you had bumps on your arms. Yeah. So do I. Those bumps you get. I don't what know kind why. Of bumps? Irish bumps. Just like little kind of. Top of it the almost feels like bumps. a. Rash. Elbows. Irish bumps. Like look, I'm gonna put this on uh, Violet's <clears throat> elbow. Give me your elbow. This elbow is dry. Yeah, give me your elbow. <laughs> no, Not what's, anymore. What's great about this? Could <laughs> <laughs> you be cuter? Uh, yeah, I think so. Right. Okay, also, so Christine. now, just going to make her really aging skin. Mm -hmm. yeah. her, her really wrinkled, terrible <laughs> aging skin looks so much better. Uh, but what? Lock in 21 year old skin. Right. Good. But what? She'll know in a while is mm -hmm. that it, it absorbs. It doesn't stay greasy on your skin. Mm -hmm. You can like I'm even snapping my fingers already. So what a great thing for elbows, for heels, for putting a couple of droppers in your bathtub when you're yeah, soaking heels. in your bath. Um, some nights instead of night cream or anything, I just put a, a dropper all over my face and then I pull it through my hair to like yeah. get the ends, yeah. put a little oil treatment, great. and smell it. 
Mm -hmm. I think there are eight or nine oils. It's like, um, oh, the first sorry. is virgin organic uh, coconut oil. Mm -hmm. And then there's um, um, raspberry oil, meadow foam seed oil, mm -hmm. um, obsidian seed oil, argan oil, uh, broccoli, broccoli seed oil, oil, broccoli seed oil. It's just wow. like all Nigella. the great essences in there. So there you go. Here's your take-home gift. Wow. There we go. Wow. This is a little you party favor for Heather. <laughs> Back to New Jersey. <laughs> Come in and get to told you look like Cindy Crawford. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna move to the table. I'm yeah, gonna we'll I'm gonna make one stuff. spring roll Let's so that. Make a spring roll. Okay. Okay. All right, Susan, why don't you sit? Can you? If I sit here, can you get that, Roger? Yep. Can you yep. Okay. I have to go wash my hands. Hi, Chi Chi. You're going to be part of Spring Roll tonight. Can you sit on the other side of Suzanne? Because I'm going to use that as a demo. Yeah. Certainly. Yeah. Try to. Yeah. Not always. Can you guys sit down with us? Yeah. I can't wait to eat this. This is so good. So, and Roger, you get to eat too. <laughs> Are you going to eat with us, honey, or you're going to go to class? Why? Well, I have no car, so actually I have no way to go. So, so eat with us. It's blocked in, actually, by Jessica. Oh, okay. Yeah. Bye. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Mr. So. Wonderful. Yeah. Okay, so first we're just going what? to say a little grace and say thank you for this family. Thank you for coming into town and visiting us. It's so special to have you here, Heather. Thank you. And I love my family. Mm -hmm. And thank you for this beautiful food. And thank you, God, for a beautiful life. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so okay. this is how we make a spring roll. So who's sitting here, Elijah? Camellia. Close. Okay. okay. So <laughs> you take one of them, you take a spring, uh, this is a, a paper <laughs> spring roll, and you dip it in the water, and it will finish getting soft on your plate, but that's how it starts. And then I like to start with the basil. This is Thai basil. You can use regular basil if you have it. I put the pretty side down so that it shows up on the other side as a real leaf. And Violet taught me this trick where she puts it all over because oh. it makes it prettier. Mm -hmm. It's just, mm -hmm. it's pretty. I liked, I liked it. It was a good, okay, so you just that's how it, it smells so good. Yeah, oh, yeah. It smells great. Okay, so then I'm going to put some of the lettuce. Can, can you, you accelerate make... this a little bit, Carol? <laughs> you can make your own now. You know how to make it. You follow the leader. <laughs> yeah, you can okay. take a thing. I'm just showing. It, okay. this, they've asked how to make spring rolls. It's part of the show. Oh, oh right. So oh, funny. oh. Yeah, so no, we're on TV. You irritate yeah. okay. your daughter-in-law and the president of our company. No, you didn't irritate me. I no. totally understand him. I'm just like, no, go no. do your thing. Okay. Okay, so you guys can start too. You know how to make spring rolls. Yeah. So you put lettuce. You're going to leave like two inches at the bottom here because that part's going to fold up. So then we made some of these. These are rice noodles. Yeah. Who doesn't like noodles? Oh, too bad. Yeah. Those are rice noodles. This is some shredded chicken yeah, that you boiled. I boiled this and, yeah. and then just shredded it. And no seasoning. No seasoning because the seasoning's the in yeah. the sauce. And this right. is a very, you know, use your hands kind of meal. You don't want to get too much stuffing in your spring roll or else it's hard to roll. Yeah. Then I have these cucumbers that I used my slicer for. And actually, John and Aaron grew these. Oh yeah? Yeah, Fun friends, John and Aaron. John is, you've met him at my house. Um, yeah. Okay. And these the are the carrots, which give it a nice crunch. And then two more kinds of herbs. Excuse me, Sina. Sorry to reach over you. Okay. Cilantro. Cilantro is very polarizing. You either love it or you don't, so you do whatever you like. And then this is fresh mint. Okay. There's still ginger and carrot. Oh, you, you did carrots. I did carrots, yes. And then if you want to try if you want a teeny bit of extra ginger, this is like you just need a little bit of this because it's very concentrated. Mm -hmm. 
And also it takes so long to peel. <laughs> okay, so now thank you. Oh Bruce, will you grab the sriracha on me? Yeah. Okay, so here's how you fold. You pull this bottom part up. It's kind of like bunting a baby. You you fold that part up. Then you come up on the side. And you want to tuck and roll. Tuck and roll. Here, Bruce. Oh, oh great <laughs> You know we can't take her anywhere. <laughs> and that is your spring roll. Yeah. So then yeah. you're gonna take the sauce. So I have the peanut sauce. Yes. Can you reach over? So you stand and you lean. Okay. Can you just get them for there me? There you go. <laughs> Bruce got them for you. Okay. Thank you. Pardon me. Sorry. Sorry for reaching up. Also, the salad. Okay. Okay. So I like to put the sauce in at the end. Some people like to do the sauce as they go. So I like to drop the sauce in like okay. this. All I need is sauce. And then. So now I would normally just use sriracha, but since Violet made this great peanut sauce that has sriracha in it, mm. I'm just going to spoon a little of that, mm -hmm. like that. Yum! And that is Did how you, you make a spring roll. Look how beautiful. Wow. That's beautiful. That's a perfect one. That okay. is. Now we're all, can we all can achieve the, the perfection that she um, has no. achieved? It's not about perfection. Yeah. <laughs> oh, here, yeah, you have your own. Here, you have your own dish. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. Oh, Hello? here. Okay. Just pour a little in his. Why are you pouring it in there? Because then I'm going to get you a spoon. Then you can make your own. Can you have cilantro, please? There we go. Yes. I love it. Apparently it's genetic. No, oh, really? like people who like cilantro or don't like cilantro is a genetic thing. Oh. For people who don't like it, it tastes like soap. Yeah, Barry Manilow, you can't so feed him yeah. um, cilantro. Cilantro, yeah. No, that's like an mm. It's so good. So healthy, so fresh. Did I put Yummy. ginger on mine? Yeah, oh, I didn't put ginger Did on I? mine. Okay. Violet, this peanut sauce is great. Oh my God, thank you. Thank you. It's yeah, such a I good can't addition. wait to eat this. Yeah, why is this thing sticking to it? <laughs> this thing? I don't know. It's okay. detective. This is the peanut sauce, <laughs> and that goes here. Okay. Right. Mm. Mm. Thank you. Ginger. Yum. Yeah. All right. I'm going to start the roll em up. All right. Can you sriracha me? It's messy, but well, it'll be good. <laughs> it's the best kind. <laughs> now I'm noticing it takes a little practice. It's perfect. But she's had more experience. Yeah. Actually, Bruce, could I have the sriracha sauce, please? Sure. Ooh. Oh, how check I, that out. There you go. Yeah. How does that Look at try. this for the rookie. I got three kids. <laughs> <laughs> I got She's your baby. I got babies. You. Yeah, exactly. Okay, here's mine. Oh, really good, Suzanne. I know. Okay. Let me try this. Mm, okay. Will you pass Heather some of the other sauce, too? Mm -hmm. uh, you got oh, some. I got it. Yeah, I got it. Ah, oh, the silence of good food. Mm, Look at yeah. this. <laughs> We're going to say goodbye soon so that Roger can sit down and have one too. This is Roger food. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Actually, so, Roger introduced us to Sriracha. Yeah, right. yeah. This is Roger food. Mm -hmm. Roger and I are food soul brother and sister. Oh, man. On the road, we find all oh, the places. We, do. <laughs> we like the same kind of food. Yeah. We both like big flavor. Yeah. Great. He always finds the best Indian, Indian restaurant food, yeah. or the best Thai place. There you go. Mm. 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 Oh, this is absolutely terrible, guys. It's absolutely. <laughs> Look at this. Great. Oh, man. Happy. Happy. Mm. Mm -hmm. Well, are you eating already? Yeah, I'm just waiting. Mm. Okay. And on a scale of one to ten, how easy is, is this meal to prepare? It's a it's like a bit of chopping, but it's it's a simple technique. It's just a lot of chopping. Yeah. 
the protein is chicken, but sometimes people just have the noodles or sometimes they just have vegetables. What I like about it is that everyone can pick just what they like and you build your own. Mm. And Alan made a salad. <laughs> but actually, day two, it is the best salad because mm. I usually have the lettuce left over and then I toss in the cucumbers and the carrots and all those herbs and the Al? chicken and the dressing and it's the best salad and the Al next day. Has a spring roll? He kind of failed. He has <laughs> other gifts. He's a visionary. He's just not a good spring roller. It's great. You can't be good. At, he, yeah, this is how you like to eat. It's great. Mm -hmm. He likes to eat with his fingers. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Well, thanks for joining us, everyone. Um, remember, if you want anything at SuzanneSummers.com. We just took 30% off the entire website tonight. The promo code is FAM30. Gentle colon cleanse. Or renew. That one. Renew. <laughs> um, I saw someone asking about the ghost flower clothes. Uh -huh. We have a, that's a partner with us. So I guess the promo code does not apply for them. I should have said that. I happen to be wearing ghost flower tonight. Um, I'll show you over here. These yoga clothes. You guys saw when we did the yoga show. They have all these cool pressure points. We have another, um, we have more styles coming for you because you guys really loved it. So in a couple weeks, we'll have that show again. Um, so sorry the promo code doesn't work on that stuff, but for everything else. All right. Thanks for joining us, talking about farts and spring yeah. rolls. This okay, was, thanks, Heather. Bye. This show is known as the farting show. There it is. <laughs> Bye.